I want to dig in today and see what we get twin flame message. Over analyst, over analyzing things in the mind. Oh, the mind, the crown chakra. So this past week with the solar flashes, I feel like a lot of people were receiving crown upgrades. I'm dressed up as a fairy, by the way, if you couldn't tell. I'm tapped into my inner child today, just having a lot of fun and going along with it. Um, but I feel like a lot of people received crown upgrades leading up and you could still be feeling like the residual essence of that from the solar flashes, from the ascension symptoms as a result of those solar flashes. So just know that's normal. You could be having an increase in vivid dreams or visions, um, remote viewing, spontaneous bilocation experiences, deja vu, uh, things coming up from your past that you're remembering very uh, detailed, vividly. Um, a lot of you could be going through hermit modes right now or just feeling quite isolated and it's because spirit is preparing you for something. Could be love, just saying. Um, and nurture. Yeah, so they want you to nurture yourselves and each other and be there compassionately for one another. And I know you have been, but they want you to do it more, okay? If you're in separation, let's see if I can get a message because that's more if you're like talking one-on-one, -on -one, but still, of course, be there for the person. You stress. Okay, so if you're in separation, it's due to stress. There's something that you're stressed out about or your person is, or you could both be, um, and it's you're having opposing thoughts. And the reason for this is because you're integrating different mental capabilities within the mind that are helping you to overcome integral parts that are going to benefit you moving forward within your dynamic. These could be shadow aspects coming up. These could be just thoughts of your own that you're learning to overcome, that you're learning aren't real. Because any thought that's outside of yourself, outside of your truth, is not a real thought, okay? It's there to help you integrate your shadow and help you to realize this for yourselves. Um, and the only way that a relationship can progress is when you come to this realization. I am an activator, so if I'm activating you or triggering you in any way, just know that's normal and it's for the highest good to inspire you and to help you understand your cosmic nature, your soul nature, your soul signs, synchronicities, pay attention to them. You could be seeing red balloons. I keep seeing coming across 99 Red Balloons by Nina, and I adore that song. I always have. But if you come across that, just know that's normal. If you're seeing 909 on the clock, <laughs> you could be going through something like that. Um, Twin flamey, wise soulmate, wise, sorry, I have an itch on my leg. Ooh, right leg itch, upper thigh. I'll have to Google that and insert it here within this reading. You're coming into your own. You're coming into your independence. You, you're just kind of like, fuck it. I don't care anymore. I'm going to be me. Um, yeah, so that's really beautiful. I think you're also inspiring this within one another. There's definitely hope here. So if you're in, if you're just by yourself, that could also represent if you're just by yourself, you're in separation. There is hope here. We have the star. There is hope. So don't lose sight. Don't lose hope of the connectivity that you know is true. If, if you know it's true, then it doesn't matter what the 3D illusion is showing. And I go over that in my Twin Flame reading. Uh, that's on my YouTube channel, so I highly recommend. Uh, and definitely subscribe if you're not subscribed. I would love to have you over there. We're all family. It's awesome. I do live streams sometimes where I do free readings or I'll do like mini paid readings, sometimes free ones. Um, I am going to be going live more and more over there and on Instagram. So follow me on both platforms. It's Kimberkiss underscore Cosmic underscore Queen for Instagram and just Kimberkiss Cosmic Queen for YouTube. Same name as my uh, TikTok. Oh, builder. Okay, so you both are rebuilding something with inside of yourselves. I'm feeling these like foundational bricks and like these foundational um, values. Morals and values that have always been there, but you're recognizing them more and more and you're building upon those energies, which is helping you to manifest it more into your reality, okay? You're like the architect here. 
and passion. You're very passionate for one another. You're very passionate in and of yourselves. A lot of you could be fire signs. I'm getting fire and air. Um, and I'm, yeah, so I'm getting Aries energy, Sagittarius. I'm getting um, Libra, Gemini, and I'm getting um, Capricorn. But if that's not the signs, then don't worry about it. That's not a big deal. Keep your relationship private, of course. Um, keep it private. There's some things that you are working on too, like passion projects. They want you to keep them private for now. You will be rewarded if you do. Okay, so um, is there any other messages here? They want you to, <laughs> they always like, okay. They want you to research Tartaria ancient Tartaria. I have to do this too. There has been a lot of research that I have done in the past, but there's a lot more I know I need to do. Research ancient Tartaria. There's going to be more coming up about this, not even just like etheric energy, electricity, free energy wise, but within the architecture of these buildings and the sound frequencies and frequency in general and the foundation. There's something here with like something you learning about the foundation of some of these ancient buildings that are going to help you like piece some things together within your own foundation because it's all connected. Um, what else do they want you to do? They want you to read a book. There's like a book that you have that you haven't read that you've been putting off. <laughs> I have a bunch of these, but this is for you specifically. This is for you specifically. You have a book that you've been putting off reading and they want you to read it. They want you, even if it's just a page, they want you to read it. Start reading it. Um, what else? They want you to do like a money manifesto ritual thingy, however it resonates for you. Um, but there's a way that you used to utilize your essence to manifest money and it used to work and it hasn't worked for quite some time, but they want you to tap into that again and utilize that. Okay. Energy and, and you will see benefits of this. Okay. Ah, that's cool. Um, make your own like manifested manifestation, like song in your head or, or poem or rap or whatever little like. Uh, what do they call it? A little sonnet or something, um, poem. Because if you keep this in your head, it's like becomes a subconscious thought and it, it's catchy, then you'll remember it. I remember I used to do this with like flashcards for like quizzes and things to help me remember my vocabulary words and things in school. So this is just some things that they want you to do to work on and it will really, really help you moving forward, okay? Um, your person is thinking about you, you feel like their energy, you feel when they're thinking about you, you know it, and you might even like notice things like happening physically when they are thinking about you, just know that this is normal. That's all I'm gonna say for now, just know that there is someone coming in with something, something, and I'm not gonna reveal exactly what that is, but it's gonna be different for each and every one of you spirits saying it could be a message directly from one of their spirit guides to you and you will know exactly what the fuck it is when it happens. So, excuse my French. I love you all. Definitely follow. If you're not following, follow me. You have a lot of fun and subscribe to my YouTube as well. And follow me on Instagram. I'll, I'll just put my little thing here so you know what it is. So, definitely do so. You won't regret it. I love you all so much.